Voters lined up at the early voting center told me they weren't letting anything stop them from casting their vote, not even a case of COVID-19. It's very well organized. Um, no one touched me and I didn't touch anyone. Um, I handled my own driver's license and slid it through. Um, they did hand me um, a straw to use on the machine. I mean, it was it was very safe. I mean, everyone had masks on. An employee at the Toledo Lucas County Early Voting Center tested positive for COVID-19, according to the health department. The employee last worked on Friday. You don't have a mask on, why not? Oh, because I forgot it. My mask, hurry somebody. Wait, do you have any extra masks? I don't, but I asked that question because yes, there was- no, I always have it because I'm real susceptible to it, but I was just so anxious to get in line here. I just wanted to double check because there was an employee in here that tested positive for COVID oh, no. on Friday. And I'm just trying to figure out if that discourages you from voting or what? No, 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 absolutely. I had to wait in my car because my breathing is hard um, and I just truly forgot my mask. Um, but I think it's so important to come out here and, and do this. Um, and it's for more reasons than just the ridiculousness that's going on with our country right now. The health commissioner says there are a number of safety measures in place at the center. We saw people social distancing. There are plastic barriers to separate voters inside. Voters are required to wear face masks. We asked the health commissioner how many people were exposed to this person. Remember, it's time and distance. So, you know, if somebody is standing in front of you for longer than 15 minutes, you know, less than six foot, uh, that's when we start having some concerns about exposure. He says he went to the facility and talked to the employees. But as we're watching people actually come through and then they're interacting with the, the, um, the individuals who are working the, 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 voting, uh, the, the voting process, um, you're not seeing an extended amount of time having somebody stand in front of somebody for 15 minutes, greater, or less than six foot. So right there, that tells me that th there really is a limited exposure. Health officials say they don't know how the employee contracted the virus, but felt it was important to tell the public. Does it discourage you from still going in the building? No, because my vote got to count. 